all right you guys welcome back to my channel my name is maria and i'm a tarot reader here on youtube and i'm going to be doing the end of the month tarot readings okay the end of the month and then the beginning of the month what the energies are going to be like okay we're going to be starting off with capricorn so let's see what's going on with capricorn hope you guys had a wonderful thanksgiving and that you guys were grateful for all the beautiful blessings you guys have had this year whether they were bad or good situations you know what happened they taught you to move forward they taught you to not associate yourself with people that are not worth it you also had good times with people that are worth it that they love you so immensely so look at life like that yeah look i feel like you've been laying down and really thinking like you've been resting and you've just been thinking about a lot of things that you've gone through that was my intuitive message you guys um just letting you guys know but yeah maybe you've been taking a rest and you've been thinking a lot about the past everything that you've gone through up to this point how you've gotten to this point in your life I feel like you're peaceful. It's like, yeah, you are thinking about a lot of shit, but I feel like overall you're doing pretty good. You're not at a super heavy, like, you're overcoming a lot of things. You're, you got problems, people got problems, but you're not like really dying hard over them. You know what I'm saying? You're handling life. We have here the full card. Okay, so the full represents embarking on a new journey, on manifesting whatever it is that you want. Okay, um, you're taking a chance. So you could be taking a chance with something new. Um, you're cho you could have a pet. You could have like a black dog, maybe a lab. I don't know why I'm picking that up, but you have a dog. And he's masculine, so he's a boy. But I feel like you've come a long way, Capricorn. Um, it's been a bumpy ride. It's been a little chaotic. I feel like you've had to walk on thin ice for a while just to get through, okay? Um, because I feel like emotionally, there's been a lot of emotional darkness in your soul. I feel like people have brought you down, but you've managed to get back up still and still continue to try. Um, maybe this year was a lot about like lessons learned. That's what I'm getting, you guys. But you're definitely choosing to move forward. This card or these two cards I guess okay I feel like there could be somebody new that you're talking to or that okay i'm getting yeah i'm getting that i'm getting that you guys for part only take what resonates you guys okay i got a lot of different messages for a lot of you guys so only take what resonates not everybody's going through the same thing but yeah i feel like there was maybe a relationship i feel like you just met somebody okay maybe at your work i'm feeling like maybe at your work or maybe, like, you got off work and you went somewhere and then you met them. Like, this is somebody new, okay? Um, and But I'm just feeling like you guys work together. <laughs> I'm feeling like some, this could, oh my gosh, it could be your boss even. I'm feeling like it's like your boss. But um, you're being very flirtatious with somebody, okay? Very, very flirtatious. Um but you're starting to like like them 
it's like you like them and you are wanting to get to know them more. Maybe right now things are kind of like just like flirty, like so, like you know, just flirt, like light, and um, you're scared that. This person might like, like you're, you're thinking of like the potential this has and how like, how this could like set you back a little bit because you like them that much. I feel like it is really still early on type of relationship, you know, it's like you guys just flirt, but you want to get to know them more. So you have the six of wands. Yeah, see, you don't know if, if this is going to like... I feel like you don't want to waste time. I feel like you don't want to waste time. Like, You just want to find somebody that's going to understand you. Oh, you're getting in your feels, Capricorn. You just want someone that's going to be pan passionate about you as you are of them you just want the same you want to meet them on the same like frequency the same vibe okay what is the energy that capricorn needs to focus on for the rest of the week these two cards came out The tower moment is over. Okay. That tower moment is over. That time that where you got hurt has passed. Okay. Like, and it came out in reverse to the judgment card. I feel like this person is, in, is interested in you as much as you are interested in them. And I feel like you need to not overthink, okay? Because overthinking is, uh, sabotages things, okay? So if you're overthinking of, like, who they're with or, or like, you just want them to fail already. Maybe you're looking at them and you're like, hmm, you're probably a slut. Like, you're probably a hoe. Maybe you're a player. Like, I know your type. Like, you're just assuming do not assume, you guys. That's not a good thing to do. Um, this isn't going to happen again, okay? I mean, it is a little fiery. This connection is a little fiery, so it can be a little bit intense. That's what I am getting. Okay, maybe when you're around this person, like, you just feel a lot. Like, they make you feel a lot. And it's weird because you never feel like that much. And it's weird because they see you the same way. You feel, I feel like somebody sees the other person as very responsible and very, um, very on fire. Like, they're the shit. You guys both think you guys are the shit. Like, you guys are, like, sub bitch type of vibe <laughs> oh my gosh that was funny <laughs> oh my gosh you guys so like lit <laughs> anyways if you guys want to go ahead and like and subscribe to my channel that would be great really help me out and i will see you guys in the next video bye